know how we died, but he's dead. Um, so we're gonna this room. Hey. Hey! Did you call me? Hey. What's this? Hey, who are you talking to? That's just my own. When I get serious, my own. What? I can't even be sorry by myself. So if I want to talk to me, that would be fine. I don't have time for this. Sorry, I'm not going to You're right. I'm gonna get it. Oh, where is it? Where is it? How'd you make? Sorry, my bad. Okay, where's the bed? Oh, no, we. I don't see the bed anywhere. Oh, there it is. Hello. No. So yeah, I need to get um. Hajime. to the cottage and it should be in the office. 
you can do it. Oh, there's one left. And I think it, it, it's in the um, old building. There's one left eye. Uh, thanks, Snowy. Um, I need your help with the next chapter now, so I can do it before the class drops. by taking the elevator located at the secret entrance. <laughs> I'll see you soon! 
Let's do it! Woo! Here we go, guys. Last trial, alright! Now then, let's begin with a simple explanation of during the class trial, you will present your... Before we begin, I'd like to confirm one thing. Is there really a killer among us? Most definitely! There's no doubt that the blackened is lurking among you! Such a sad state of affairs, isn't it? By the way, this class trial is gonna be 100% fair! So there's no need to worry! I'm the type who hates favoritism and prejudice! Well, not as much as I hate Monami, of course! You hate me that much? Now, let's begin! You're telling us to begin, but what are we supposed to do? No complaining, let's just settle this with our fist! Were you even listening to the rules? Didn't that Biakia bastard get killed in the dining hall, huh? Then everyone there is a fucking suspect! I yeah, yeah, chicken. what you're really trying to say is that you're not the killer, right? No shit! You guys went off on your own and started killing each other. This has nothing to do with me. Huh? What does that mean? Anyway, why don't we try talking about the most pressing issue on our minds? Huh. The most pressing issue on our minds? Where we found the body. It's very strange to find a body underneath a table. Then, let's start with that mystery. Why was Byakuya's body in a place like that? His body was underneath the table at the very back of the dining hall. After the killer murdered Byakuya, they probably moved the body there. Huh? Why? Obviously by hiding the body, they tried to delay it just like a dog burying a bone! Why was Byakuya's body in a place like this? body was under at the very back of After the killer, they probably moved the body. Yeah. No, oh, that's hey. not. Let's go. Woo. Oh, I love this. I love this. It's such a really good No, I don't think the killer moved the body. Huh? Try to remember what the body looked like when he found it under the table. Though there was a lot of blood everywhere, there was no sign the killer actually dragged the body through it. So that's why you think it's impossible that the killer moved the body. I see. I get your point. Aww. And here I thought I had a genius idea. Too bad you're so stupid and boring and unpopular. Your life is meaningless. I respond better to praise, you know. But if the killer didn't move the body, why was it under the table? Yasuya was probably killed under the table. What? You think he was killed under the table? So Byakuya snuck under the table for reasons unknown. See, that's and Makoto's that's when voice. he was killed. Then, shortly Makoto. thereafter, he found his body under the table. Th that does make sense, but why did he go under the table? Obviously he was hiding so he could surprise us. That dude was always a big jokester. The hell he was? You seriously couldn't tell what kind of person he was? <laughs> Maybe he panicked during the blackout and dove under the table. It's a blackout, not an earthquake. Just because the power went out doesn't mean he'd dive under the table. The reason why is probably connected to what Byakuya was doing during the party, don't you think?
the table. It's connected. Okay, what's the way of the party? That's probably. I tried the thread. Yakuya probably noticed the knife was hidden there, so in order to get it, he moved under the table. He was particularly sensitive to the presence of dangerous items, so I cannot deny that possibility. But how did he notice that there was a knife under the table? If he knew beforehand, he probably would have done something about it before the blackout, right? Then, instead of knowing about it beforehand, maybe he saw it right at that moment. Like, for example, he might have seen someone trying to take the knife out from under the table. No, that's not possible. What? You seem rather confident about that. Of course. I have proof to back me up. <laughs> this is almost like a real trial! It is, Thomas. Byakuya ducked under the table during the blackout. That sounds correct. If that's the case, during the blackout, Mr. Must have seen the killer, but it was super pitch. It was so dark I couldn't see my Byakuya couldn't see in the dark either. I doubt he could have seen the killer. That's way. Alright. I'm sure Byakuya during the black that sounds correct. If that's the case, during the blackout, he must have seen the killer. But it was super it was so dark I couldn't Byakuya couldn't see in the dark. No, that's wrong! I love that. This is good, I like these costumes. No, a bit hard. Yakuya was probably the only one he was able to see in the dark. Why do you say that? He was using those night vision goggles we found under the table. He could have seen what was happening. So... Are you saying Yakuya was the one who used those night vision goggles? Yeah, that seems to be the case. Your reasoning is out of focus! What? What's happening? No, that's obviously wrong. It should be the other way around. Really? The other way around? Seriously? The killer used those night vision goggles, not the Akuya. Yes, I was. Just use common sense. 
The killer obviously used those knives. That's gotta be it. I can't back down. What? If you just use common sense, the killer obviously used those knife digits. That's gotta be it. Where's your proof that the killer used them? Because if they use night vision goggles, then they could have killed Yakuya even in the dark! And in reality, that's what happened. So those goggles were playing in the dark. The killer brought them to the crime scene! Because if they use night vision goggles, then they could have killed Yakuya even in, in reality. So those goggles were playing. The killer brought them to the crime scene. Because if they use night vision, they could kill Yakuya even in, in reality. That's so those goggles were playing in the dance. The killer brought them to the crime scene. Because if they use night vision, they could kill Yakuya even in So those goggles were playing in the The killer brought them to the crime scene. Damn it! If you just use common sense, the killer obviously used those night vision. That's gotta be it. Where's your proof that the killer used them? 